Hey this is Res here and today I'll be showing you guys another 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 mod of mine. I worked on this one for about a month and a half for the fictional 2024 modding jam in the theme of escape room. This mod contains no spoilers and features cool escape room mechanics and a companion you can talk with. If you guys plan to play it for yourselves, I don't suggest you watch this video, but if you don't really care or are struggling with my mod, enjoy the video. Hello? Who's there? Phew, that's a relief. Who are you? My name is Colin. Colin? My name is William. Do you know this place? I have no clue what this place is, William. I'm just as confused as you are. I just woke up from this shock and now I'm stuck here. Do you think you can find a way to turn the power on? It's impossible to see. I'll take a look around. What the hell is this place? The time just started in my room. This, this is mental. Who's sick enough to put us in a place like this? And what happens when that timer reaches zero? Okay, okay. Think calm. Think calm. Let's look around our rooms and update each other if we can find anything. Let me know if you can find any way to get out. Of course. What a fascinating contraption. Hey, something just opened up in my room. Did you do something? Yeah, I rotated something. Some hatch opened up with a button inside. I'll try to press it. Huh. Just music. That was odd. There must be some use for it. These are a lot of papers. Insufficient power. I need to get the power back on. Hey, Colin, I found something. There's a sign here that claims we need more power to get this door unlocked. Colin? I think that's the door leading to my room. I also have one on this side. We have to find a way to get the power up and running. I'll update you if there's anything in my room that can help. Huh. Doesn't seem to do anything. Hey William, can you do what you did a couple more times? It's revealing a lever in my room. Sure thing. I can pull the lever now. Give me a second. Did it do anything on your end? Yes, it revealed an odd contraption on my end. I believe I have to get that ball to the dark spot using these buttons. Seems like something unlocked.
A white powder. I better keep it in case it is used for something. This place looks fairly fancy. I wonder if someone lives here. Huh. Well, isn't this peculiar? Word. This is... this is revolting. Ah, the stench. What has happened here? I believe I saw something that looks oddly familiar to these descriptions around here. I am the night sky with a serrated edge of flame. I'm above the dark sea, lit by bright jellyfish. I'm a shadow in flight with a blaze of red below. I'm a fiery heart with dark borders dotted in light.
Good heavens. Hey, William, do you, do you also see that matchbox? I do indeed. Are you planning on getting that? See if there are any objects around that could be of use. The hole is only big enough to fit my hand, and there are no items the right size in my room. There are also s syringes. What do we do? The time is ticking, Colin. We have to find a solution, and quickly. Are you certain there are no other objects in the room? I don't want to put my hand in there, William. What happens if I get injected with something? I'm not sure, Colin. But I'm afraid your hand is our only choice. As much as I don't want to believe that, it's true. Regardless, the hole is blocked by a gate. Do you think you can somehow get the gate open? This padlock doesn't seem too stable. I'll see if there's a key around here. Or maybe there's another way. This won't work. It's too light. I need to find something heavier. That was simpler than I thought. It says right here that you have to keep the screen just lowering down. I'm counting on you. I believe this button should do the trick. I can't advance, William. You have to keep the syringes up. I'm on it. Yes, I've got it. Keep it steady, William. We're almost there. That was terrifying. It was indeed. I am relieved that you weren't harmed. Now, these matches ought to be useful. I'm going to be dropping down the matches through this hole. See if you can catch it. Five coal required. This must be how I get the power back on. But how would I get these rocks out of the way? This coal piece is way too large. I must find something smaller. A good size might be one that I can carry in my pockets.
bloody hurt! Huh, that's interesting. What? What is happening? Colin! Is everything okay? William, can you make it over to this side? The door is locked. I'm locked in. A timer? And it, it... It says only one of us can make it out. What? William, what do you mean only one of us? There has to be some way. There's less than 30 seconds to choose. What? What do I do, Colin? No, no, no. This can't be happening. We were both supposed to escape. Why this? Are you gonna kill me, William? I... I need to choose something. Good luck, Colin. William, you're gonna save me? But what about you? What? What's this? The, thank you, William. You've saved me. Help! Help me! William, if you don't remember it yet, I am you. That's... that's me? The potion you drank before sitting on the chair should have cleared your memory. You were tested on the moral of your own human nature. The rooms were built to connect you to someone and test your moral, assuming you were not aware of your scientific nature. You see, William, we are scientists. We learn to adapt older discoveries to newer and more accurate representations of their true essence. And sometimes sacrifices have to be made. A human is more than capable of giving accurate readings compared to those pesky lab animals. William, we've made quite the experiment. We call it the Beast. You, you are great, William. The Beast shall not harm you. You may leave...
I'm sorry. Colin. William. Why? What sick joke is this? How could you do this, William? How... How could... How could you do this? Help! Help me! William, if you don't remember it yet, I am you. That's... that's me? The potion you drank before sitting on the chair should have cleared your memory. You were tested on the moral of your own human nature. The rooms were built to connect you to someone and test your moral, assuming you were not aware of your scientific nature. You see, William, we are scientists. We learn to adapt older discoveries to newer and more accurate representations of their true essence. And sometimes, sacrifices have to be made. A human is more than capable of giving accurate readings compared to those pesky lab animals. You chose to save yourself, William. Even after learning of their situation, without being aware of your scientific nature. You are no better to society than an erratic murderer. You must face your consequence by welcoming our greatest experiment, the beast. We have to find a way out. Colin, urgently! There's no hope. Colin. Colin! Ah! This... this is the end. I'm on it. Oh God, William. What did it inject in me? Will... Will I be okay? I really hope so, Colin. Okay, here I go again. Please be careful. Fuck! William, it hit me. It fucking hit me. Oh my. I'm terribly sorry. Colin. Lift it up, please! Right away. Oh God, it hurts so bad. What the heck is in these things? I wish I could tell you, Colin. I'll try again. Be careful. Oh, finally. That hurt so bad. What did it inject in me? William? I don't... I don't want to die. We should keep on moving so we can get you to the hospital as soon as possible. You're right. Are you planning on getting that? See if there are... Hold on, Colin. I believe I just managed to get this lock off. 